the U.S. and Canada jobs reports for June look, quote-unquote, much better than expected. But what am I really looking at, and what should you be looking at? Hello, my friends. My name is Evan. This is The McChronicle, coming to you a little bit late, frankly, on July 10th, 2023, where the future starts today. Yeah, the jobs number came in hot. Looks like the Bank of Canada is going to hike rates again in July. And it also looks like the Fed's going to do the same thing as well. But what's my big takeaway here? Well, if you watch my video from last month, you'll know I'm starting to track wages. And look in Canada, funny enough, wage growth is now at 3.9%, the weakest in a year. Which if you factor in what inflation really still is right now, Real wage gains, there is no wage gains. It's way negative. And by the way, if you want a little more about the actual report, I'll leave this up on screen here for a few seconds. Nonetheless, I'm going to say it again. I am following wage growth at this point way more than the actual numbers. And here's the number for the U.S., as you can see, wages here actually were slightly, quote-unquote, stronger than expected. The average work week was also up here as well, as you can see in a bit more detail. Is this a change in the trend, though? Looking at it on the surface? I really don't think so. In fact, CNBC put this chart out from the U.S. Bureau of Labor... Wage growth peaked in the first quarter of last year, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, and it's been slowing ever since. Yeah, we have, we've had some slight upticks along the way, but the general trend, look at it, it's still down. And with rising rates and the pressure households are currently under right now, this definitely ain't going to help, is it? That's my big reason why I am following this. It's not necessarily for the wages itself, but the fact the effect of this has been exacerbated by rising interest rates and the stress that that's putting on households who are carrying more debt than ever before. And really, that's where I fall on the whole thing. Was a little bit late. Thought I'd make this quick. Now I'm going to off here to watch the Home Run Derby. Whether you agree, disagree, or have anything else you want to add, leave it in the comments down below or in the replies in the socials. And as always, my name is Evan. This is the McChronicle, where the future starts today.